Hey guys, Alex here with Trilby Gaming, bringing you my second attempt at Hollow Knight Steel Soul Edition. I will be... I have just run through the tutorial area. I'm going to smack down this door, because that's what you do when you're opening Hollow Nest. Hollow Nest. And from there, I am going to be continuing from what I did last time, where I'm going to grab... Uh, I'm going to ignore El... Do I, do I ignore Elderbug? Nah, we'll, we'll speak to Elderbug. I'll rest. Talk to me. There we no, go. No, no. Now I feel no, good. Obvious. Okay, so. The plan. The route has not changed. The... The... The things that I'm going to be doing have not changed. I'm simply going to do them better. Because if you didn't watch the first... My first attempt at Steel Soul, I was way... I played very cocky. Um... I played so cocky. I, uh, yeah, I just pushed it in places that I really shouldn't have pushed it, and I know I shouldn't have pushed it. I was just, yeah, I think because I'd, oh, crud. I think because I'd previously, um, I'd previously done a load of recording, I was getting a bit, oh, no. I was getting a bit, uh, you know, I was getting a bit, uh, a bit hasty in the way I was doing things. So, that means that I'm going to speak to Cornifer. And I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna buy this map. Thank you. Um, I'm then going to make a move. And now that I am making a move, up. Ah! So now that I'm here, I need to go right and then up. Um, my plan is to get enough money to open the stag station. And then when I've got the stag station, go and kill False Knight. And I'm actually, I'm still gonna kill him. Um, I still think killing him is the right move. The money is great. Hot springs, because I need a rest. Fun fact, actually, today I was helping a friend of mine move. So, I've been carrying washing machines, and uh, tumble dryers, mattresses, bed frames, all of the, all of like the, the heavy stuff, mirrors, but you know, it's fine. It's, um, <laughs> I'm glad that he's gotten himself settled, and uh, his place is really nice. So, it, I'm flipping shattered, but it's but it's it's a good day. It's a good day. Oh, wasn't expecting to see you there. I can't do that yet, which is just a shame. Oh no, I tried to I tried to be fancy. I swear they're called Gorms. I might be wrong. Um, if I am wrong, I do apologise. But I believe I'm right. Oh, a little bit tight. Three away from 69. Oh no, we got we got the 69. We got 169, but I did take a hit for it. Totally worth it. <laughs> totally flipping worth it. <sighs> worth it. So now that we're up here, getting the station. Ah, oh, here he comes. Here he comes. <sighs> Bye, mate. <laughs> Stag station is done. So there is a grub that I've actually missed in previous in my previous run. There's the grub right here, so I'm just gonna kill these asps, aspids, get the grub, yay. I know this is all stuff you've seen before, but, you know, it's, it's a cool fight, so, I will, I will show you the way I destroy false knight this time. Can we get a damageless so false knight? Come on, stick your head out, there we go, there we go, oh, this is, this is good, this is good. This is going pretty well indeed. Yep, and now goodbye! <laughs> the death animation is like so intense, and then the sound effect is. <laughs> okay, so we got the city crest. Don't forget the money, because that's why we fight him. We fight him for money. Oh, you! I forgot that you exist. Ow! I forgot that you exist! Oh, I feel really stupid about that, I'm not gonna lie. Should not have taken that hit. I'll admit that, that there are a lot of cuts in this particular section. Just because I kind of want to try and get a... Um, I mean, I want to get back to the bit that, we, that we've done before. Oh, I know where we are. Alright, we'll, 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 we'll do this now. We'll do this now, we're ready. We're ready. There we go. Cool, Grass Mother's dead. We get some money. I'm actually kind of annoyed that the uh, the babies here don't 
Uh, oh, really? No damage on Grasmother, and then I take a hit from you guys? Get out of it. Um, yeah, I'm a little annoyed that these guys don't actually drop money. Um, but it's, it's fine. Not the end of the world, I guess. Hey, Mr. Cooper. If you know that reference, then I'm pleased. Or you watch the first episode, which I'm also pleased. Wait, this isn't the way to go. God damn it. Don't know what happened there. I got a little, got a little, uh, a little bit lost, not gonna lie. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Give me the spell. Give me the spell. Yep, 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 yep. Cool. Now I've got the spell. And now we're unconscious. I've got to admit, as I'm going, I'm a little concerned with how much Geo we've got. I mean, we've got enough for one Mask Shard and the Compass, but we don't have enough for both Mask Shards and the Compass. I think we're good to go. There we are. Oh, this mini boss is so annoying. Oh no! You freaking suck! Die! Yay! First charm! You've slain that b creature before, I've even asked. Yes, I have. I scarcely deserve a friend such as you. You're a marvel. Yeah, let me out. So, 650. I think we can get most of the things that we want at this point. What's over here again? Um, oh, money's up here. I'm glad I came over here. Maybe I will get... So my plan is to get um, one mask shard. And, um, and then everything I need from Iselda. So the... Um, the quill, the compass, um, all of that wonderful fun stuff. Just gonna do a little exploring first. I can't reach you! I'm sorry! Oh no! No! Okay, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh! oh. I was being too, uh, being too cocky. We'll save the grub. <laughs> uh, now that I'm up here, I've just had a thought. I, Bapanada. Bapanada. I didn't actually... <laughs> I didn't open the stag station to dirt mouth yet. <laughs> um, okay, so we've got the compass and we've got the quill. Unfortunately, that only leaves enough for one crud, one mask shard. And I want from you the mask shard. Thank you. Okay, two green paths. I'll just go get this guy out of my way. Ah ha ha! Gotcha! Sweet! Okay. So now, we are officially... I've been recording for 20... Oh my god, I did it again. Okay. Look down. Sorted. Now heal. Don't fall in the lava anymore. The acid anymore. And then, let's continue. Oh my god! Okay, I'm getting flashbacks from when I was last here. Oh my god, that was not great. So, there's an enemy up here that I can use for soul. If I'm clever. Yep, okay. You, however, need to get out of here. Yep, so I've got some soul. Awesome, so I'm probably not going to do so many cuts now that I'm in green path, just because this is new for you guys. <gasps> oh, oh, that's not good. That is not good. Is there somewhere that I can stand down there? Yeah, there is. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Bye bye. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. So. I I can't remember what I mentioned the last time I was here, but I'm looking for Hornet. My plan is to find Hornet. There is actually a speedrun skip that I can pull off. I don't think I got to it last time, so I'm gonna I'm gonna hop off here and I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna see if I can try it out. There's yeah, there's hidden money in there. I saw you. I saw you. Thank you very much. Appreciate the money. Okay, there's Hornet. So this marks an area where I can do a skip, if I'm clever. No, I can't. <laughs> I haven't got the... I have not got that timing down. Essentially, the idea is that... 
Ooh. Look, look, before you leap, Alex. Look, before you leap. Um, yeah, the uh, the idea is that you use the... <gasps> Alright, that was, that, was, that was quite lucky. That was sheer luck. I'm not even going to pretend that I knew what I was doing at that point. Um, but yeah, you, you use the kickback from, um, from Vengeful Spirit to kind of knock yourself up there. But you, it's just like, the timing's tricky. Um, and I do not know the timing. Ow! Um, so yeah, that's unfortunately not something that I can pull off right about now. Nothing to break, no? Uh, what about up here? Cool. So it just means that I need to go the long way around, which is fine, because, you know, not a speedrunner. This is not a speedrun. It doesn't matter. Uh, okay. Um, so I can't break that just yet. That's from the other way around. That's a uh, shortcut, if I remember right. But what I can do is kill you, actually, because you're just irritating. So what I actually can do is just hit this and kill you. You can get out of it. Um, yeah, I hear you, bud. I hear you. Cool. So I'm just going to quickly buy this map. Cornifer is over here. Yo, buddy. Isn't this contrast from the crossroads? I've done my best to chart the area, though. I must admit, some of it has been hard. Um, at least that's what I think he says. But yeah, we got the map of Green Path. So, we are... I didn't equip the compass charm, did I? God damn it. <laughs> God freaking damn it. Um, okay, so I'm just, I'm going back. I'm going to, I need to go left and down, I think. Uh, or just left. No, wait, I don't go left. What am I talking about? Where do I go? Oh, so, I came back. It's down here, isn't it? It is. I'm just going to quickly go back and open the shortcut. Sweet. So now that that's done, we can get back here later whenever we need to. You represent life and money, so goodbye, my friend. Can I get a two for one? I didn't even get a one for one. Well, it's fine. I guess this means that I actually get the money for it, so... Yeah. Swing some roundabouts. And now we're going to go and see the best character in the game. Okay, well, immediately when I say best character in the game, I guess I mean my favorite character. I actually loved this system when I first played this game. So you talk to this guy, Tiny Squid, you approach. Yes, are you a hunter like me? Yes, I am. To stalk, to kill. Yes. Then take it to my journal. It will aid you. So I freaking love this. I absolutely love this. This made, this kind of changed like the way that I played the game a little bit. Don't know if this is the same for everybody else, but for me, I freaking loved it. So the idea is just, you know, it tells you the creatures that you've killed. Uh, but if you kill enough of them, you get additional notes, such as, for the crawlid, uh, dull and pathetic, hardly worth killing. Um, and these little descriptions are actually, like, I found them really interesting. I really wanted to know what they were as I was exploring this game. So, yeah, I, I will be collecting the journal in every, uh, in every attempt of Steel Soul that I do. Don't care how long it takes me. Does not matter. Hello, Mr. Grub, I saved you. I missed. There we go. Give me that. Yes. See, this is where I need to go. Yeah. Oh, Hornet! Bye-bye! So we're getting close. We're getting close. Ow, you... These things just suck. Obbles are horrible. They just, like, they float around meaninglessly and fire in, like, four directions. Like... Oftentimes, I just get hit because I'm an idiot. Also, that plant wants to eat me. Um, I will kill it for the satisfaction, but uh, yeah. Kind of uh, kind of Crash Bandicoot creepy plant vibes right there. But I guess that's how these games go. I guess that's how these games go. Um, okay, this is new. So, Giant Bush it actually hides a mini bug inside. You have to hit the bush to make the uh, make the little guy go up, to make the. Ugh, what am I trying to say? Use your words. Oh, 
I literally just healed that as well. That's just a pain. Come on, give me the soul. I need it. Thank you. I do need it. Um, yeah, they're just they're just annoying. You've got to like release the the bug underneath the bush to get a hit. But I like I don't have quick slash or um, or anything fancy, so it takes ages to actually um, uh, to actually kill them. It takes three hits, and like they're delayed. It's just slow. Oh no, that was stupid. But this is fine. I need the money. Totally worth. You know, we're still doing okay. Still on five. Don't know what you're talking about. We've lost a little bit of soul, but you know, it's fine. Oh, you. Oh, God. Freaking damn it. Oh, oh, obbles suck. Oh, God. I hate obbles. Obbles are ridiculous. But there you go. Um, okay. So here we are. I'm now going to spend some money on a bench. Well worth it. Best 50 geo I've spent this side of a stag station. But now we can update the map a little bit and we can also put that compass on. So now, on the map, you can see where we are. But more importantly, it will hopefully mean that I won't get lost so much. Which I greatly appreciate. That was rubbish. Ah! Oh, die! Thank you. God, I hate obbles. God, they suck. <sighs> okay. Oh, no, no, no. I shouldn't have swung my sword there. So every time you swing your nail, every time you hit something, it knocks you back slightly. Um, there is a charm to get rid of it, but it's literally the most pointless charm in the game. Because you just get used to it. Like, the visceral feedback, like the feedback of like getting knocked backwards a bit just makes it feel better. I don't know, I just, I really like it. Like, guys, just Hollow Knight's good. Go, go play Hollow Knight. Um, oh, no, no, no! Okay, I want to go in that thing up to the right. That's what I'm aiming for right now. Um, yeah, up here. I think there's a, there might be a secret, a little bit of additional exploring. It'd do me good. Ooh, I know where we are. Been here a few times. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Alex, you idiot! Oh my god. Where am I right now? I'm over here. Yeah, I'm definitely not where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> um. No, we'll go for story things. We'll go for story things. How are we doing on time? I actually, I have, um... Uh, fourth wall breaking for a, for a quick second. I actually... I need to take a break from this attempt. Um... Yeah, I need to take a hot break from this attempt. Um... Because we have the, um... Yeah, I've actually got another recording session booked. Um... With, uh, with a large group of people. So, um, so I do want to, um, I do actually want to find a bench and, um, and call it a day, I guess. Well, there was a bench further down. Do you know what? Yeah, I'm actually gonna, I'm actually gonna wander down and I'm gonna call it. Um, oh no, I can... I changed my mind, I want to kill Hornet. <laughs> oh, god damn. Um... So it's not this way, is it? It's not this way. Oh, where do I go? It's to the right, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's you. You could get out of here. Ooh, yep. Oh, crud. Got me on the back swing. Oh, no. Got me on the actual swing now. Hey, there we go. I will take it. I will take it. Ah, here we go. Yes. I know where we are. 
Now I know where we are. This is fine. We're making decent progress. We're making decent progress. So. So, 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 so. We didn't get this far in my first attempt. <laughs> but this is the worst character in the game. Meet Zolt. Not the thing that's eating Zolt, but the thing being eaten. The thing eating him is the King Vengefly. So I'm just going to casually kill this uh, kill this overgrown bug because it's good. To, good. Oh wow! I, that was just dumb. But yeah, give me, give me some, give me, give me your your children to maul to death so that I can get more soul. Stop screaming! Come on! Come and get me! Come and get me! There we go. That's what I wanted. Come on. Yes. Okay. So now that uh, now that this guy's dead, so why is Zolt the worst character in the game? You ask. Well, um, for this reason. Bear in mind, we just saved his life. Just what do you think you're doing? You dare to come between me and my prey? Is it a habit of yours to scurry about, getting in the way and causing bother? Yep, that is how he treats his savior. Know this, Kerr, I am Zolt the Mighty, knight of great renown. Cross me again and you'll find out while, I'm at, while they call my weapon Life Ender. Get out of it. But, you know, we saved him. Guess... Guess because we're good people. No, psych, I wanted the money from the bench flag. I literally, I've got, I've already got the, there's actually an achievement if you leave him to die. Because <laughs> you can leave him, spoiler alert, you can leave him to die. Oh no, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. I should only trigger one of them at a time. So there's two down here. Uh, there's a lot of money, uh, which is nice, but yeah, the, the fact that there are two of them guarding it, they can get a little bit um, much together. So one on one is fine. I'm probably going the wrong way, but you know what? It's fine. Yes. Give me all of this money. Sweet. Give me all of the money. Okay. So, I believe Hornet is down here and to the left. Get out of here. Am I right? Yep, I am right. Okay, how are we doing on time? We're doing good. Carl, I haven't had, uh, I haven't had such a productive day of recording um, for quite a while, to be fair. Come no closer, ghost! I've seen you creeping through the undergrowth, stalking me. This old kingdom, a terrible thing awakens. I can smell it in the air. I know what you are, I know what you try to do. I can't allow it. But what do you know? So she has knowledge. Um, she has knowledge of things. Oh crud, no I missed. Oh, crud. She's generally pretty quick, but all things considered not a big issue. Oh, crud. I literally, I, I, I literally walked into that. Oh, crud. Should have jumped. Alex, what are you doing, boy? You're making an absolute tit out of yourself is what you're doing. <laughs> cool. Yes, that's what I wanted to do. Come and get me. Yeah, throw your needle. She literally fights with a needle and thread, by the way. Just in case you were wondering, like, it's an actual needle and thread. It's great. I love it. I love the design of this character. It, she's so freaking cool. There you go. Have, have, to, have a spell to the face. And just her voice acting, too. It's just... She's just so good! Ah, oh, She's literally the Hollow, Knight, Hollow Knight's answer to Spider-Man. Okay. Yes. There we go. Okay. So now that she's down, we're actually gonna do we're actually gonna do a bit of a uh, bit of story beat. So we're gonna pick up this thing. So this is upgrade number two. This is the Mothwing cloak. The Mothwing cloak is extremely useful. Extremely. This is like one of the most useful items in the game. But what we're also gonna do is this. Would it seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. So we meet these three. 
These are um, uh, these are the uh, these are the dreamers. So I guess minimal spoiler we we will be seeing them again we will be seeing them again we uh, we actually need to kill them before uh, before we can we can uh, we can finish the game oh and also um the mothwing cloak lets you dash in the air and on the ground extremely useful extremely good i will be using it a lot <laughs> is there anything over here wow alex is there anything over here? Yep, yeah, there is. Where is, does this take me? Where does this take me? What is over here? Anything good? Anything good? Oh no, I remember where this takes me. Yes, this is actually a really good spot. Welcome to the Lake of Un. I'm actually going to just beat this guy up for ow, for money. Um, so I want you to come away from the edge a little bit, mate. Come and get me. Come and get me. Come on, come on, come on. Yep, yeah. alright, alright, sweet. No, don't jump backwards. Don't jump backwards. Hey, give me the money. Yep, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. And healing was actually right, such a waste there because here's a bench. <laughs> um, and before we go, I will introduce you to Quirrell. Oh, this is Quirrell. Um, oh, hello there. It seems we both tread far from the path. I can hardly believe those dusty old highways led to such a lush and lively place. This building suggests some form of worship, though its idol has clearly been long forgotten. Doubles equally well for a moment's respite. That it does. Um, you might recognize the mask that uh, Quirrell is wearing on his head. Um, I won't tell you why you might know that, and if you don't know that, then I'm sorry. But otherwise, guys, that is game. Um, the night has fallen asleep. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed for watching. This is my this is the first part of my second attempt at Steel Soul. So as I say, Steel Soul is I've got to finish the game without dying. So I have to I have to yeah beat the three dreamers and then the game's final boss. That is that is what I need to do. So if you've enjoyed this, if you've enjoyed today's episode, then episode video, yeah, because this isn't going to be quite a uh, quite a an often series. Um, but if you've enjoyed today's episode, then feel free to give it a like. If you didn't give it a dislike, that is absolutely fine. Leave me some feedback in the comments down below. And um, yeah, if you know any secrets or like um, things to find uh, with the Mothwing Cloak around in, uh, in either the Forgotten Crossroads or Green Path or the third area that we're going to, which, spoiler alert again, sorry, I'm full of spoilers today. The third area is called the Fungal Wastes. So if you know some if you know some secrets, sh throw them up in the comments down below so that I can actually like so I can find them because I don't remember where all the secrets are. <laughs> but guys, on that note, take care of yourselves and until next time. <laughs>